Deep in the heart of China are the Qinling Mountains, an enchanting and mystical place that not only houses many natural treasures, but historic secrets to this ancient civilization. Established over 1,000 years ago during the Han Dynasty, the town of Huayang is nestled deep inside the Qinling mountain range. This ancient town was once referred to as paradise, but today struggles for survival. Survival for themselves, and survival of their natural resources that surround them. Once a thriving timber and agricultural community, the attention has now shifted to the critically endangered animals that have been recently discovered in this region. The rare giant panda was discovered living here in the Qingling Mountains by a visiting professor only a few decades ago. Now, thanks to foundations like the World Wildlife Fund and dedicated individuals like Forest Ranger Zhang, 300 of the world's 1,600 wild pandas call this region home. I once a prosperous logging community, Huayang harvested over 100,000 trees a year to fuel China's Industrial Revolution. Deforestation halted in 1995 when the Qingling Mountains were established as a natural reserve in hopes to save these newly discovered treasures. With the closure of the timber industry, Wyong fell in economic hardship as thousands of workers became unemployed. While these changes burdened the village, the tiny population of endangered golden monkeys have flourished in this region. And now over 4,000 of them climb these ancient trees in the Qingling Mountains, one of the few places left in China where these monkeys exist. Another animal that has benefited from these policy shifts is the crested ibis. For decades, these birds were thought to be completely extinct. But in 1981, seven of these vanished birds were spotted feeding in the rice paddies of Wyong. From the original seven, a rigorous conservation and breeding program has increased their population to over 2,000 birds today. With the crested ibis inhabiting the local rice fields, Farmers agreed to ban the use of chemical fertilizers and pesticides, in doing so, sacrificing over one-third of their income. When faced with hardships and challenges over recent years, the people of Huayang have made courageous choices and sacrifices. The re-emergence of these three rare animals has once again ignited Huayang's hope for survival. And thanks to the concerted efforts of the villagers, there may be hope for both humans and animals alike on the unpredictable and arduous road to paradise.